Yo, what's good up there? It's Ricky Tice. Maybe uh, change that shit around a little bit. Yo, on my way to uh, on my way to uh, Bronzeville, Brooklyn, East New York. Why are I mean, I get this phone call from a woman that that we met up somewhere in Manhattan, that we sat down, talked, ate, and I paid the whole bill, big deals, you know, so what? She's telling me, like, oh, you know, I was an abusive person, da 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 I'm thinking, like, I hope she ain't got me confused with my own pops, because my pops could be doing that bullshit. And just giving women out my damn name and number. Actually, we both got the same name. He'll probably just give him my number just to throw him off. I'm like, I'm like, who is this bitch? Now, she came, she was calling me about a business proposition. Talking about, I need supporters so I can get my baking business started I said baking business okay oh she needs $25 she's trying to get she needs clientele and stuff so she can get a grant I said yo I can get, grant, I can get grants easy no problem I can get grants I can get grants for whatever I need it for I don't have to worry about paying it back. It's free money. Now, for the small type of business, because me, I like to help people out with small businesses and help them build up so I can get a little piece of the pie. Because I was good with business. Helping others out, build them up, Send them on their way. I get a little piece of the action. That's it. Done deal. So. She was like. Oh you know. We just want to know. You know. If you're going to willing to support me. If you're going to send me the money. And stuff. I said to her. Give me the name of the company. That you're working with. So I can get some more info on them. Or. Or if you like, I can get your business started off right <laughs> in a couple of months. Oh no, I just need the money and stuff. You know, she's like all oh, chucking and giggling in the background. I'm like, yeah, I know. You fucking black women are fucking scammers, man. You a scam a good dude because you're behind on your rent. You're behind on your car note. You're behind on everything. You're giving me the fucking story. You've been beat up. You've been abused. Your uh, your last boyfriend or last or uh, last husband beat the shit out of you, and now you're all fucked up in the head mentally and stuff. Oh yeah, I have a beautiful body and stuff. And I'm like, I don't give a fuck about that shit. If you've been in a domestic abuse relationship, there's no turning back from that. What you should have, what she should have did was beat his ass while he was beating your ass. Fucking, you got teeth, right? Fucking bite the shit out of him or something. Beat his ass. He's throwing fists at you. You should throw fists back at him. Stop crying. Stop singing, and start swinging. You know, fuck the women. You let men beat you up. I'm saying, women. You gonna let these fucking pookies and railways beat you up and shit? You better fight back. Don't just go down to your friend or like, oh girl, he beat me up, girl. I'll be alright. We'll be we'll be okay. We'll be okay. Two or three weeks later, you're right back out there with him. All I asked this chick was. 
give me the name of the company you was working with. So I can call them up or check them out. See if we can make some investments going on. Because I want a little piece of this bakery. I'm saying action myself too. She caught a fucking attitude. Why don't you just, you know, it's going to come out of your debit card, your bank account, whatsoever. Da, 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 da. No, 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 sweetheart. It don't work that way with me. I will give I will make out a personal business check from my bank account. I'll go to my bank. I'll go to one of my banks and make a personal check. Out of you know, just a check. Go to a business, right? It's going into their account to help you build up. I just want to know who who am I sending the money to? Oh, it's got it's coming out of your debit card. Oh no, 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 no. She's like, she caught a fucking attitude with me so quickly. I was like, yo, why are you so mad? You speaking business to me. I'm speaking business right back at you. Why are you so mad? Getting mad at me for? You're the one asking me for money to help you out with your business. But you caught an attitude right back at me when I was asking for the company. What's the company's name? I need a I need a routing number. I need a bank, you know what I'm saying? I need a bank account number and a routing number. Where can I route the money to? Right. Because I have one of my business accounts that I have a little piece of stock in that I bought like three shares of it. I plan to buy more. So I can piss off one of them fucking white boys in that company. Telling me like, yo, don't let them buy no more. <laughs> I'm gonna buy as much as I want. You know. But I'm like, yo, the chick caught a fucking attitude. Yelling at me, cursing me out of stuff. You ain't, you know, God sent me here and da 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 like yo, chick, I guess you don't need the money then. Got an attitude like that. If you don't talk business with me, I'm talking business right back at you. I want to know the name of the company, their location, who can I contact, you know what I'm saying? All that other good shit. She called an attitude. A fucking attitude. I was like, yo, that's why I don't really fuck with black women no more. Attitudes. Even though they sometimes they're fucked up in the head still. Attitudes. I offered out a helping hand in business, but they caught a fucking attitude. Why the fuck are y'all still mad at the brothers who are doing good with themselves, who are doing good with their kids, who are still doing good at pretty much everything, getting their lives together or having lives together or pretty much doing better than I mean, why are they so fucking angry? They are fucking, they're like fucking furious. They're mad. Like, oh, he did this to me. I'm like, I didn't do shit to you. <laughs> they are still angry. And it's Christmas time. Because I figured like, oh, she's trying to scam me for some money. Because she needed to buy gifts. It's Christmas time. And I was like, to me, I don't give a fuck. I'm the fucking Grinch. I'm going to be a Grinch. I'm going to be a grouchy ass old man. I'm putting the fucking coal on all you fucking broke bitches. I'm putting fucking hot coal on all you <laughs> broke bitches. You think you want to do this shit here to me? You want to do this shit here to me? I have all your asses down at fucking Canal Street selling fucking bags and shit. You know what I'm saying? Shoe program. Go make them fucking Nikes. Put them on the street. Sell them. Make my fucking money. 
said, I don't fuck with no broke bitch. Especially the desperate ones that's looking for cash on the side. Easy cash. Da -da -da -da. I don't want to start my own business. How are you going to start your own business you never went to school for it? You never took any classes for it? You know? I'm going to start cooking bitches and fucking everything. Saying cooking oil. Crisco, the one that come out of the can. You know what I'm saying? Fresh, hot grease. Damn, she fine. Go ahead, mama. Oh, never mind. A black chick pushing a white baby. Fucking nanny. Fucking hate that shit. Slavery is still real. <laughs> Nannies are pushing white babies. You know these fucking. So oh, sorry, bus driver. So yeah. <laughs> so entice, yo man. These broads is fucking real, yo. It's getting close to the fucking holidays. It's getting close to Christmas. You know what it is. These broads are going to be desperate as fuck. They're going to hit up every dude out the fucking phone that they haven't even talked to in a year or two years. Coming out the blue, they're going to hit you up asking you, how you doing? We haven't spoken to you in a long time. I just thought about you. I wonder if you can help me out with something. I have a situation. I have a business going on. My kids need food. I, I fucked up on my on my food stamps. Um, 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 I don't have any money to get my hair done. Can you help me out? Oh, I'm stuck over here. Can you come pick me up? And that bitch could be like, I had one time this chick called me up saying like, oh, can you pick me up from JFK Airport? I'm at the JFK Inn and I don't know, I don't have anywhere to go. I was like, oh, I say okay, then oh well's then. <laughs> I can't help you out. Not my problem. I said, you are not my problem. What's wrong with this fucking cat? Get the fuck out the way, nigga. <sighs> Going down Fulton Street in Brooklyn, man. This shit is real. So, yo, like, share, subscribe. I'll be back later on with another video. Because I'm going to East New York Broadway Junction. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Peace.